Time to hear from the skipper, Verizon Wireless. Inside we go, post-game comments, Buck Showalter. We, um, I guess, you know, you're happy with the way your offense played. But well, you know, we sco- you know, in most cases you'd like to like your chances at six runs, but uh, one of the problems with them, and you know, when they get the ball down there to the three guys, three or four guys that got down a pin, you, you, you're hoping to, the way we had worked in the first couple of innings that uh, we could get him out of there before, the, before we did and try to get some other guys in there, but where we could open it up a little bit. You never feel comfortable with the lead. And, uh, you know, that's testament to uh, him keeping the club in the game and uh, not giving in there because, you know, we had a couple opportunities to open it up, but I was happy with our approach to him early on. You know, we forced him into throwing a lot of off-speed pitches, which, which he doesn't normally do. Buck, the bullpen has been a strong point for you over the past couple of weeks. Mm-hmm. It didn't happen tonight. Was it something you saw or could pinpoint? Is it just the game of baseball got the better? No, we were obviously we had uh, three guys we were trying to stay away from tonight, and um, and if it'd been a little later in the game, we just that early in the game there we kind of got um, made some pitches that you know made some good pitches too that <clears throat> got us to that opportunity. Jake uh, battled his way through five innings and uh, kept the damage to a minimum, but. Uh, you know, a lot of good players over there with a track record, and they make you pay with, for the mistakes you do make. But, you know, I, I, I lean a little bit more towards what our guys did to get us in that, that situation. There's a lot of good at-bats off of obviously one of the best pitchers in the league. Look, um, you said before the game, you know, how Lester's pretty much owned owned the Orioles. I didn't say that. I would never use that word. Kind of. I, didn't, I would never say somebody owned us. Okay, well, he's 13-0 and 0 now. I mean... Mm-hmm. How impressive is well, that? Well, it gives you an idea how close we were to beating him tonight. You know, I, I I don't dwell on, you know, I look at it that, you know, we're a pitcher or in a bad away from getting him out of the ball game and, and that not being the case. I don't know if he's had any no decisions during that. I don't, you know, I kind of li- like to dwell on what we did to, uh, you know, to give ourselves that opportunity, the positives that, that we took out of tonight, what went on here in the past. You know, I'm certainly aware of it because somebody always makes me aware of it. And, uh, don't really, I like to dwell on what we did against him tonight. And you force him into that many change-up, cutter, breaking balls, it tells you that uh, you know some guys are having some good at-bats off of him. Give us an update on uh, Jones's back. He came out of the game. Right? Uh, I, I tell you, it wasn't so much the uh, up against the wall. He just, uh, the one swing really bit him. And, uh, you know, I'd, we had talked uh, after that bat that, you know, play defense and see uh, if it if it because it's happened a couple of times and it's kind of loosened back up, but uh, didn't tonight. Uh, he wasn't going to hit there in that situation anyway. Patterson's uh, a little dinged up from uh, the uh, collision in uh, Chicago with the fence, so we were we had some things there that weren't at uh, as available as they normally are. A couple others too. Characterized Jake's performance tonight. He had the battle. I mean, yeah, he had a little. Yeah, he had a little trouble. I don't know if um, he had a little trouble getting the ball away from his arm side. Kept pulling the ball across, out and over. You know, I'm not gonna. you know, make your pitches when you have to. You know, he made some good pitches. His tempo is something that, that uh, you know we got to get better with too. Of course, Boston dictates that a lot as much as they step out of the box and and talk to the umpire a lot about calls. Thanks. Okay.